Hi, everybody. It's Diane with So Boutique. And today I'm going to do something really, really fun. I'm going to share with you our website and answer a few questions that you've had um, over the past several months or, you know, it was back even into 2020 that we've never really kind of come out and answered. And we've incorporated several of your suggestions and comments and, and things into our website. And I wanted to take you through a little bit of a tutorial demo, whatever we want to call it today of our website. And um, hopefully it'll answer some of your questions. And if you do have more questions, please continue to, to send us um, anything that you would like to see different and um, help us improve. It really would be great. So what I'm going to do is take us over to the website and you're going to think this is kind of funny, but I enlarged my cursor, if you see that, to be bright pink. <laughs> I think it will help us go through this process really, really easily. But okay, here's our homepage. And on our homepage, you can always click on the So Boutique and you will come right back to the main screen. So if you get lost down one tunnel of fabric or something else, just know that just go back up to the top and click on the So Boutique and you'll go back to the, the main portion of our website. But right below that, you will see the tabs, I call them tabs, and options that we have organized across the top of our option list here. And it starts out over here on the left um, with the new items, the sale items, the clearance items, the fun things, the, basically the thing that I always look at when I go to a website, which is what's on sale, what's new. And so I go there all the time. So that is where you'll find anything cool, fun things you just can't miss right over there. But then what we've done is we're a fabric company. So we have organized all of our fabrics under this second tab. And it lists all of the batik rayon, the Jersey knit, 115 inch wide cotton, our 45 inch wide cotton and the nuance gradations. So you can see and click easily to get to the fabric that you want to focus on. Okay, we know that we design fabric for more than one user type. So we design garment fabric, we design quilting fabric, and we just want to make our website easy for you to follow. The second tab now gets into that focused area where we focus here in this tab on garment sewing. So we have the fabrics that we relate to garment sewing. Our fashion duos are our kits that we put together so that you can save when you wanna buy a pattern, the notions and the fabric all together. We also have an option for you to select the type of garment you're looking for, as well as any fabric packs that we've put together and the, the garment patterns and books. We have the same exact um, tab for quilting. So if you're a quilting person, you're looking for table runners, wall hangings, quilt kits, whatever that happens to be, and the fabric relating to those, you can click on this specific area. Then we come into the Sew Boutique for the home, and we have a, we kind of separated this out because it does um, help us focus on the things that are specific to Sew Boutique for the home. So all the kits that deal with our um, duvet covers, our ironing board covers, and anything like that. So um, that is definitely an area to focus on there. And then um, the next tab over is handmade and handmade is an area where we like to focus on the scarves and, um, anything that you can buy that you actually don't have to do anything with. You don't have to sew, you don't have to cut, you don't have to do anything. It is a finished garment or item. The next tab focuses on our patterns and notions and thread. And this again is organized by quilting and by garment sewing. Here's the thread that we offer and then all of the notions are right there. The tab that follows that is news. And this is basically a little area that I probably don't spend enough attention on, but um, whenever we come out with a new fabric or a new project kit or anything like that, I like to feature some notes that I um, 
like to share that I can't share in a picture of a duvet cover as an example. So I talk about um, various ways to cut the fabric, how I went about making it. I did the same thing for our summer color block jersey knit um, t-shirt and dress. And so click on these every now and again and find something fun and um, hopefully educational to help you complete a project or to learn something different. And then the last, I'm going to scroll back up here. The last option over here, tab over here, is a little bit about So Batik, about Bruce and I and our history with the company. And this is very important, the care instructions. I am going to click on that. And the care instructions tell you how we would like you to take care of the rayon and the jersey and the cotton and what to do. And it's very simple instructions in the products that we use when we do wash our fabric when we make our samples. So definitely take a look at that. And then a little coupon fun again over here and some events, whether or not they're physical events that we're going to, or if they are virtual events that we're supporting throughout the year. So definitely look at that. And then any general questions and answers that you might have. And that's where our shipping information and um, returns and customer service things are on our website. Now, the one other thing that I want to show you is down here in the lower left-hand corner is a button called message us. There are times, whether it be, I don't know, before we open or, or after we've closed, or you just simply have a question and don't want to pick up the phone, just click on the message us and send us a quick note. And, um, you know, just ask the question, what are you looking for? What, what are you trying to, um, to, what do you need help with when you're on the website? Or is there a fabric we can help you with or something? So definitely send us a quick message or just say hi. <laughs> it's kind of fun to get those messages and we'll quickly respond. You'll get an initial message that says, we've heard you, um, we'll be right back and we'll get you an answer. So um, hopefully we're, we're relatively quick with our responses there. But again, I'm over here in the care instructions. So what I'm gonna do is click on the So Boutique and I'm gonna go right back up to the main homepage. And um, that's sort of kind of the navigation of our site, but the homepage itself really quickly, we have an area up top that is like a little slideshow. And there's arrows over here where you can click through um, if it doesn't already slide on you, but um, it'll show you different featured items that we have um, and some of the fabric options that we have. And you can click on these boxes and it'll take you right to that specific item that's being featured up in the slide set. Okay. Underneath the little slideshow, we have a daily featured item. And today it happens to be the Batik Rayon. And then we have a featured project. And this was from yesterday. We had some computer issues yesterday. So I left up the sale for another day. Then we have our new arrivals. If we really want to feature something or if we've added a lot of things to our website, this is the new arrivals section. And then, oh, this was a new collection as well. So we do a lot of new features before we get down into the various product categories. And this area down below, all the way to the rest of our website now, kind of gives you pictures of all of the various options that you had when you were up at the top of the screen. So um, you don't have to continue to go down if you don't want to, but sometimes people are visual and want to see the pictures or you can select where you're going if you're familiar with our site from the top portion of our screen. Okay, so that's kind of the navigation of our website. And I hope that makes a little bit of sense for you all. Um, the, I would say the number one question that we have from you guys is, how do I add a yard and a half of an item to my shopping cart when the minimum item is a yard? How do I do that? And the quantity field doesn't give me an option to do a half of a yard. Well, let me show you a couple of things and hopefully this will answer that question. So I'm gonna go into fabric and I'm gonna go into the 115 inch, actually I'm gonna do the rayon, batik rayon. Let's say we are going to find a fabric that, okay, 
I am making a top right now out of the Violetta Valentine Pink. So I'm going to click on that. The screen for this specific item comes up and you're going to see the um, option to look a little bit closer at the fabric. The name of the item is always at the top plus the initial lowest price for this item. So this happens to be $14 a yard for this petite rayon. You will then see this option that says select cut size. Click on this little down arrow and you will see a display of all the various yardage options that are available. We wanted as many different increments as possible. So um, they kind of go, this, these are in quarter yard increments. And that typically can get you close to whatever yardage you need for your specific garment. So if we wanna order two and a half yards, we're gonna click on that. It's gonna show in our cut size. And then it's also going to change the price. So this will automatically calculate the two and a half yards will cost $35. The other information on this item screen is a quantity field, which I'm not gonna talk about right now, but you don't really need the quantity field when you're ordering the yardage because you have the option to select from so many different yardage options. There's also a, a detailed description of the item. And this becomes really detailed when you get in and look at a fashion duo or something like that. But I'll show you that as well. Um, but once we're done and we've decided, yep, we're going to get the two and a half yards of this specific rayon, we're going to click add to cart. It'll show you your shopping cart and what might be in it already. This may be your first item. And so... I guess I have more than one in there. <laughs> anyway, we've got more than one item in there, but let's say we just, okay, I'm gonna remove that other guy. So we're gonna remove that guy, but we have one item in here. And if we're done with our purchase, we can continue on, but I'm not gonna do that yet. I'm not, I'm just gonna kind of leave this here. And I've decided I'm gonna add a few more things to my shopping basket. So, that in and of itself is how you add yardage. But I want to show one more thing. I'm going to go to the 115 inch wide cotton. Okay. It'll show you the header again, and then our detailed list of items with their images. So we have Violetta Dusty Denim. And again, same thing. Here's a detailed image. There's the item name and the starting price for one yard of 115 inch wide cotton. Again, you can click on this and you will see that most small twins are gonna take two yards of fabric, two and a half for a twin or a double. Queens might take three yards, but again, you really do need to know the measurements of your um, quilt to understand how that converts into yardage. So, but you can click on any one of these, okay? And it'll change your selected cut size and the price. Let's say you are, I'm gonna change this to two yards. Let's say you've got um, two little boys and you're going to create a twin um, quilt for each one of them. And so you need two of these. You have two yards here and we can change that quantity to two. And we can add that to our cart. And the price didn't change for the individual two yard cut, but the total does change to be $98 for two of those cuts. Now there is a dilemma here because what we do when we see this is our first guess is that, okay, um, you want two cuts of this, but what we actually really do is we will cut you continuous yardage unless you say otherwise. And, um, cause we sometimes don't know you might want that to be continuous. And for some reason, the inventory was not showing it available. So down here on our shopping cart, there is an add a note to your order. Simply click on that and type in 
we want two two yard cuts and we will do that for you um if you forget that it doesn't really hurt anything we're still going to send you continuous yardage because we want to make sure that if you really meant to order four yards that that is what you have so it makes a big difference okay um i'm going to go back up here again and i want to show you one other option too and these are just different variations to what is available when you select yardage for fabric and um the what i'm going to show you next is an option for a fashion duo the fashion duos you know let me show you something up front here i'm going to go into our um the pullover dress which is made um with a McCall's pattern. And it's also made with our newest collection of the Lirio fabric. And there's a lot of options included in this, as you can imagine, because not everybody is going to want the fabric that I made the garment out of, which would be, um, we would all be very boring walking around in the same blue and white garment. So we want you to have your option to buy whatever fabric that you want to have. So um, here's what I'm gonna go through here. Again, here's the first image of one of the items. The title of the item is here, Fashion Duo Pullover Dress Plus Petite Rayon. And the starting price on this is $42. So, and we can read the description down below of what is included in our fashion duo. It's the McCall's pattern and you get to select the size. It's interfacing and it's the rayon that you would like to make your garment from. Right underneath this big image here, we include a, an image of the garment as a completed sample, various poses, I guess, if there's more than one that can show the des design of the actual garment. And then you're gonna see all the different fabrics that we initially believe show the best for this specific garment sample. And um, we're also with this particular item featuring a new collection. So this one is our Lirio collection. Um, so you can see all the different colors. Here's one that shows our existing collection of Durham Dreams as well, which is a border. So um, this pullover looks really, really beautiful in um, a bordered batik. But as you continue through the different color options that we, we've selected for this, here's one called Spray Lake. And Spray Lake is an all over hand dyed design. And so that doesn't have a border. So this would be a gorgeous dress. Um, and then I have to honestly say, you're gonna see our solid black in a lot of different garments because it is um, versatile. A lot of people like to wear black and um, it's the, a beautiful drapey um, fabric. But um, so that is always an option in here as well. So that's where you're going to see um, our recommendations for the fabric, but there's always another option. And I'll show you that here in a minute. But so now much like the item yardage, we have all the different characteristics of this item that you need to select from. I'm going to move that one out of here because that's a, that's a boring square. Um, the first thing is what size do we want? We're not all the same size. So we can select the pattern based off of size 8 to 16 or 18 to 26. Sometimes it only the patterns only come in one, one size pattern. So you won't have this option. Um, but we want you to make sure that you have the right uh, size. And if for some reason you don't know which size fits you, not all the pattern designers design the same. There, I always include a picture of the back of the pattern jacket. So you can see the size groupings and then the measurements for every single one of the sizes, okay? You just have to keep looking down lower to find all the measurements for your specific body style. 
Okay, so we're gonna come back up here. So we're gonna select eight to 16. And then here's your rayon. Which rayon do you want? Again, there's a drop down little down arrow. And um, you can select from any of the ones that we have added here. And the minute you click on one of these, the color of the fabric shows up. So you know what color you're interested in. Okay, and you can confirm that that's the one you're looking for. Okay, then there's this option down at the bottom called select your own rayon. Select your own rayon means we didn't offer one of the fabrics that you want your garment made from. You can make, we will custom kit every single fashion duo to any of the rayon, or if it's a jersey kit, any of the jerseys, regardless of what we have in this list. So let's say, for example, I'm looking on the wall over here. Let's say, for example, you would like to have the Downton border that is green, um, which is the color ivy, and you want that one. So you're going to click select your own rayon. So now we've got the size, we've got the rayon, and we're going to only order one of these. And so we're going to add that to our cart. Okay, we're going to go over to the cart now. and. Our item is here and it's $42. Now it does say that's our size and select your own rayon. Now let's go back down here to the comment section. First and foremost, know that if we have that option that shows up as enter your own and there's no comment here, we will email you and ask you for your selection of fabric so that we make your custom kit the way you want it. But since you're on the website, there is a note field here. Type in Fashion Duo, my fabric selection is Downton Ivy. That's my example here. And um, we will get that comment and we'll make the kit accordingly. So that is how we order fashion duos and that's how we kind of create them. Um, and if you have questions on those, definitely continue to give us a little message us and we'll help you with that while you're placing your order so that you don't have to wait and come back to it later. Um, but um, hopefully that was clear. So we've ordered this fashion duo in that size and the select your own rayon, okay? And down below, are the comments telling us at Sovetique what fabric you want your kit made from, okay? Now, let's see, anything else that might be a little tricky? Um, I don't know, I think that uh, thread, for example, I'm gonna show you one thing with the thread, but all of our threads, we've set them up so that you save a little money every time you buy more than one. So it'll show you that like the serger thread here for one is $8.10. If you buy three, it's less than $8.10 times three. So you're always going to save. And we have a little chart down here that shows you what your discount is when you buy more than one. Um, I'm a proponent of getting lots of individual shades that are close and then putting those three or four in my serger so that everything is the same color gray. So that's kind of, I don't know, I end up buying a lot of variety of different colors, but if you want one color and you know you need three cones to work on a serging project um, or a quilting project, whatever thread you happen to be buying, then buy the multiples because you're always gonna save. Okay, so I'm gonna take us back up to the homepage and let's just say, We've ordered everything we want to order. And oh, by the way, we had a discount code. So let's go to our shopping cart and check out. And I think what I have to do is move my little screen there. There we go. So up on the upper right-hand corner, we have four items in our shopping cart. Now, the one thing that's really good is those four items are over $100, so you get free shipping when anytime you order over $100. Um, domestic only, I 
have to say that. So um, otherwise it would be $6 flat rate shipping. So now we're on our checkout page. And um, I always wanna make this note too. If you're paying with PayPal and you have, read this up here, have a promotion code. I'm scrolling down here to show you one thing. There is this option on the screen that I don't seem to be able to fix and change and move yet, but I'm trying, which means that you can click on the PayPal here and it'll complete your checkout if you have an account, like if you've already logged in and it knows who you are and all that with the, within our system. You can click PayPal here and it'll help you complete your purchase, but you wouldn't have entered your promotion code. So I always suggest, and that's what this little note is up here, up above here is to click the checkout button. And I know it's a little confusing and I'm trying to remove this, so hopefully I can. But if I click checkout, it will take us to our checkout screen. And I'm gonna move this back up here again. Um, and, oh, I already did put one in. So I already had put in ASG21, which happened to be an active um, code at the time. And it has discounted all of my items to whatever that discount happened to be, okay? So here, I'm gonna get rid of that code for now. Um, our system also only allows one code at a time. So if you type in a discount code, um, It'll accept that, and it, but it doesn't stack them. But it will also do a very interesting thing. So let's say, for example, we have one discount code active today, which is Rayon 17J, which is 17% off of Rayon. So it isn't valid for items in my cart, okay? Had it been, it would display it below, okay? Now, if for some reason you believe that you're getting an error message, message us with your cart open and we will get back to you. But otherwise I do have one, um, actually I'm just gonna put in ASU 21 one more time because we know that works. It will apply the code and it will show you your new price and it's still gonna show you that it's free shipping because it's still over a hundred dollars. And then you go over to this right uh, left side of the screen and you can enter any information that you have. So if you have an account with us, and I do suggest to do that because it is such an easier way to finish your purchases, um, but set up an account, give the email information, your phone and everything, and then you can complete the payment process, which is the easiest process of, of anything. So you can pay with PayPal or whatever it happens to be that you choose to pay, um, pay with. So that is, all you have to do um, at the, the checkout time. Now you may also have a gift card, okay? So if you have a gift card and that doesn't matter if you have discount codes or anything, gift card is a form of payment. So enter your gift card number in here. And I know ours are very long, they're 16 digits. And enter that in, click apply. And it will also then adjust the balance before you complete your purchase. And if your discount or your uh, gift card covers the whole balance, then it still requires you to complete, give us your billing and shipping, and um, you will be charged nothing. So your gift card will simply be updated. Okay. So that is how you complete a purchase. Now, what I'm going to do is go back to my cart and then you can always make adjustments. You can remove items. Let's remove this one. You can change anything. So let's say, for example, you on this backing only want one, not two. Change this by clicking the minus sign here. So now I only want one and hit the update cart button and your cart will now show the new um, total. Okay. So I have shown you kind of, I'm going to go back to the homepage the homepage, where to find all of our fabrics and kits and books and finished homemade items, care instructions and any other information. 
as well as how everything is structured. So if you have any questions or um, just want to make any other suggestions, by all means, um, continue to do that. And um, I hope this has been uh, informative. And I know it was long and kind of boring. I should probably put music in the background so you can um, tap to the to the music as we go through this. But um, hopefully you've enjoyed this and just know that we're here. Our phone number, 877-235-5025 if you have any questions and or message us down in the, the lower right-hand corner of our website and email us and what else um follow us on facebook on instagram uh watch our youtube channel and um actually we're also on pinterest so look for different ideas there and we hope you have a wonderful day enjoy